Welcome, seekers of the unknown. Today, we journey to the remote and eerie reaches of Alaska, to a place shrouded in mystery and fear. Welcome to Port Chatham, a once thriving fishing village that now stands abandoned, its history steeped in inexplicable and terrifying events. Port Chatham, also known as Port Lock, was established in the early 1900s, a beacon of hope for those seeking fortune in the Alaskan wilderness. The village thrived, with its bountiful fishing grounds attracting settlers eager for prosperity. But something sinister lurked in the shadows, something that would ultimately drive the inhabitants away. The local legends speak of the Nantianak, a creature akin to Bigfoot, known to stalk the forests and terrorize the villagers. Whispers of its presence grew louder as the years went by. Hunters and fishermen began to vanish without a trace, their bodies never recovered, leaving behind only blood-soaked ground and shattered equipment. The Tlingit people, indigenous to the region, spoke of the Nantianak with hushed reverence, describing it as a guardian of the land, angered by the encroachment of humans. They believed the creature to possess supernatural abilities, capable of vanishing into thin air and moving silently through the dense forest. As more and more villagers disappeared, the once bustling port grew silent. Fishermen reported seeing strange shapes in the fog, hearing guttural growls that chilled them to the bone. Some claimed to see glowing eyes staring at them from the tree line, vanishing the moment they tried to approach. In 1931, a logger named Andrew Kamluck was found dead in the woods, his body brutally mutilated, his head crushed by what appeared to be an enormous force. Despite the grisly evidence, no predator was ever identified, and fear began to grip the community. In 1940, a prospector named Alfred Hills went missing. Search parties combed the area, but found only his abandoned campsite, his tools scattered, and his rifle snapped in two. The villagers were terrified. The Nantianak was no longer a legend but a tangible threat. The death of Kamluk and the disappearance of Hills were only the beginning. Throughout the 1940s, sightings of the Nantianak increased, each more terrifying than the last. Witnesses described the creature as towering over eight feet tall, covered in dark, matted hair, with eyes that glowed menacingly in the dark. It was said to emit an overwhelming stench and move with a speed and silence that belied its size. By the 1950s, the village of Port Chatham was deserted. The remaining residents, unable to withstand the overwhelming sense of dread, left their homes and livelihoods behind. The forest, once a source of sustenance, had become a place of nightmares. The village was left to decay, reclaimed by nature, and the legend of the Nantianak became an eerie ghost story whispered among Alaskan communities. To this day, the ruins of Port Chatham stand as a testament to its haunted past. Modern explorers and paranormal enthusiasts occasionally venture into the area, drawn by the chilling tales and the hope of uncovering the truth behind the legend. Some report strange occurrences, unseen footsteps, distant growls, and the feeling of being watched. In recent years, researchers and thrill-seekers have documented eerie phenomena in Port Chatham. In 2009, a team of investigators reported hearing disembodied voices and finding enormous footprints deep in the forest. Their equipment malfunctioned frequently, and they described a pervasive sense of being watched by unseen eyes. In 2018, a documentary crew spent several days in the area capturing unexplained noises and movements on camera. Despite their sophisticated gear, they could not identify the source of the disturbances. 
Their footage shows dark shapes darting between trees, strange guttural sounds, and occasional glimpses of glowing eyes in the darkness. Historians and cryptozoologists continue to debate the true nature of the Nantianak. Some suggest it could be a surviving member of an ancient species, while others believe it to be a spectral entity guarding the land from those who would exploit it. The truth remains elusive, hidden in the dense, silent forests of Alaska. Port Chatham, where the line between myth and reality blurs and the chilling echoes of the past still whisper through the trees. Will you dare to uncover its secrets, or will you, too, become just another part of its haunted history?